Hey guys, um, so the lighting is really, really terrible because I wasn't really planning on filming and um, TJ and Ella are downstairs. I just got out of the shower. Um, but I, 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 I'm kind of stumbling over my words because I'm so um, excited and nervous. And um, I really am, I actually just, I cried a lot happy tears. I cried a lot of happy tears in the shower, so I kind of got it out already. But TJ and I have been talking about having another baby for a while now, and um, we've just kind of had a hard time. Um, we knew that like no time would be the perfect timing, but we're trying to be, um, you know, smart about it. And um, we decided today that we're ready to move on and have a child again. Um, and I think it just kind of hit me in the shower. Like, I, obviously, I was so excited that, like, we finally were able to decide to actually do this. Um, but it just kind of hit me in the shower that, like, I'll meet my new baby this year. And that's so amazing because I'm just so excited and it's something that I've been really, really looking forward to and waiting on. And, um, it almost doesn't feel quite real yet. <laughs> I don't think it's going to be real until, you know, we actually, um, you know, conceive and take the first pregnancy test, which um, I'm hoping to share that experience with you guys on today's video. I'm kind of shaking a little bit. I'm just so excited. I'm excited. I'm nervous. I'm going to try to get all the sleep that I can now. <laughs> but I'm just really excited because we'll have a new little, a new little addition to our family and Ella will have a little brother or sister and I'm I was so excited that it's actually finally starting to happen. So I just, I just wanted to share this really special moment with you guys. Sorry, I hate filming in this stupid angle, but um, I just feel like if I don't talk about it, I'm gonna explode. Um, plus, I have to run home, uh, change real quick, get some food, and I'm off to my next job. Um, so I don't really have a lot of time to sit down and talk, but maybe a week, uh, two weeks ago, I took a another pregnancy test, as you guys saw the first one that we tried back in February did not come through. A couple days after that uh, first one, I had gotten my period. And um, actually, I think, the, I think the same night that I took that test, I got my period. So um, I had taken a second one and that one was unfortunately negative as well. Um, that was a couple weeks ago and I figured, well, maybe, you know, I just, I did it too early. I didn't do it close enough to my next menstrual cycle. Um, so currently today is a Friday and I was planning on taking one um, next Wednesday because that's um, I, maybe I'm just off on my menstrual cycle I, I'm not really quite sure but I thought that I wouldn't get it again until the beginning of April and um, so I was gonna wait till Wednesday to take another test because I figured by then you know um, if, if I was pregnant it would stick and um, while at work today, after having one of the worst days that I've had in a while, um, it, I, I, my menstrual cycle started again. So I'm pretty, um, I'm pretty heartbroken, but um, I, I know it's just not time yet. It's not, um, I believe, you know, in, in not necessarily plans of life, but I uh, do have a faith in God's so I do believe that it just, God knows when I'm going to have another child, um, if I'm, if I'm ever blessed with another one. And, uh, I just got to remember that it's not in my time, it's in his, so I have to be patient. Uh, not that I'm against keep trying, not, not that I'm against keeping trying to get pregnant. <laughs> um, I, I know TJ is not, <laughs> but, um. I'm pretty heartbroken because I really thought that, you know, we looked at my ovulation cycle and really, 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 really tried um, 
this month so I thought for sure we were able to get something to stick and uh, no that did not happen um, and that's uh, that's okay I'm going to obviously keep trying and keep my head up um, it was just it was really tough to uh, after a day like this that was just really crappy um, so we're, ju we're just gonna keep trying so there's there is the update <laughs> We have kind of like another update. Um, I don't know when the last time I updated you guys was. I kind of forget at this point. I don't know if it was last month or the month before. Um, but right now it's May. It's a couple weeks before my birthday. <laughs> We're still not successful. I getting pregnant, I got my period again. <laughs> and I'm just, I really wanted it to be like a birthday surprise thing. Like, I really wanted it. <laughs> I don't know, this is what, the fifth month we've tried. And it is just like, Every time I get my period, it's like such a stab in the heart because I want another baby so bad. <sighs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to like just kind of pour out. I honestly just kind of want to get this out so it can go to work all day today. <sighs> and that's the other thing, like I've been so stressed out and so tired. And I don't know if that's a factor. I don't know if that's why nothing is sticking. I don't know. I feel like the light looks crazy. I don't know why. And I don't know if we should just keep trying. Or if at this point I should go to the doctors to see if something's genuinely wrong. Like it was so easy with Ella because she wasn't planned. And like that's not a secret and I'm not ashamed of that. I'm so proud of that little girl, but she wasn't planned, so I wasn't thinking about it and I wasn't worried about it. It just happened. And I feel like I don't know, like I feel like God is just there telling me like not yet. Not yet. It's not supposed to happen yet. And I'm trying to remind myself of that. But it's so heartbreaking because just, uh, how many times can you fail at it? <laughs> so it's been a long stretch of months. I think we first started officially getting, trying to get pregnant with our second child um, in March. Beginning of March maybe. It's now, um, June so there is that um, we obviously haven't had any luck the past couple of months and we talked we're like should we sorry it's a big truck um, we talked saying should we go to the doctors is there something else genuinely wrong Ella was so easy we didn't even try <laughs> so, <laughs> so now that we're trying it's all I can think about however Today I'm gonna go take a pregnancy test and you guys are gonna come with me because I can't remember when my last period was. Um, and it's weird because I had been using the app on my phone called Clue and I was marking down when I had my period every month, like I was doing really good. And then May rolled around and I forgot. So I don't technically know when my last period was, but I'm like, I feel like it's been a long time since I got my period and the only thing that kind of gave me a clue as to when my next period would have been was I remember saying to myself that I'm not gonna I said good I'm not gonna have my period on my birthday but it's gonna start right after my birthday like right after my birthday. I remember myself thinking this when I was trying to make my birthday plans. So it's now, I mean, it's much later for you guys at this point, so don't be hating. This has been a long process, but it's what, June 13th today? And there's still no period. 
So I'm like, all right, two weeks after I thought that it'd be starting, we probably need to go take a test. So that's where I'm off to now. Um, I do have to go to work for 8 and 7.24. So I'm hoping to just shoot to Walmart super quick. I gotta pee, I'm holding it in. That way when I get to work, I can take it. And I guess we'll find out. So it's been a little bit since um, I've had any like pregnancy updates and everything. Um, it is now August 9th, I believe. And unfortunately, my period just started today is, well, today is day two of my period. So again, um, no baby this month, but we're still trying. Um, this month, however, we're gonna try something different. Um, I am going to try to start taking some prenatal vi vitamins. Um, I've been kind of expressing my concern to other mothers and they're like, we'll start taking prenatals. Like it might actually help you. I don't really know at this point. I'm really w willing to do anything. Um, but I have been like searching online because my husband and I were talking about like, you know, what, what if we need to go to a doctor and see if something, um, you know, there's a, like another underlying problem. Um, but a lot of people just recommend or like the internet re recommended um waiting a full year like trying for a full year so if we're not pregnant by march of 2019 um you know my husband and i agreed that we'll go um you know i'll, I'll go and take fertility tests see if it's me see if it's uh, see, see if there's something up because to be honest i haven't like been to doctors and been taking care of my body so you know there could be stuff that I don't know about um but just kind of give you guys an update I'm gonna be taking these and I'm not gonna stop taking them until I become pregno prego and then after I'm prego I'm gonna be still taking them so I just want to let you guys know that this it, this is gonna be in my routine um this is not something that I showed on my vlogs however because of course, this video will eventually come out, um, but it, at, at the moment, it's still a secret. So this will not be in my vlogs, um, but yeah. I can't even believe it. it happened. It happened after a year and two months. A year and two months of trying for another baby. We haven't. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, oh, oh god. Oh, so many more car seats. Oh my god, baby formula. Oh my god, so many diapers. Oh my god. Y'all, I'm losing my mind really now. Like, I don't even feel like it's real. Oh my god, I've been praying for this baby. Oh my god, I can't even believe it. Ella's gonna be, oh my god, there's gonna be two of them and they're not gonna stop fighting. It's gonna be so much fun. Oh my god. I always feel like I'm, I want to pass out. And that's why, I guess that's why I haven't been feeling too good in the morning. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're gonna have two of them. Oh my god, oh god, I gotta birth again. Oh, I can't do that all over again. Oh my god, I gotta call the hospital. I gotta make an appointment. I gotta go see an OBGYN. I gotta see over. Oh my god, I feel like I'm gonna pass out. What? Like, this is more shocking to me than like when Ella came because I wasn't expecting it. Like, this second one I was trying for. Oh my god, this one already gave me a hard time. Oh, I need to like catch it. <laughs> What? What? I, 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 yeah. Oh my god. I'm sorry. Y'all, I'm giving myself the biggest headache. <laughs> yes! Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Oh, okay. I gotta feed my cat. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yeah. We're gonna play a quick game. A unicorn too. Ella, who's that? Daddy. That's Daddy. Okay. And then. And who's that? That's mommy. 
And who's that? Ella. Ella. No. <laughs> what's that? What, what's that? Where is that on my body? A baby. Do you know what that means? Because you're having a baby. <laughs> I have a baby sister. Do you know, you know what mommy's trying to tell you? You're going to be a sister. Baby sister? Oh, brother. We don't know yet. What? Here we go. Here we go. You have in your baby in your tummy right now? Is it working out from your butt? Oh, yeah. I'm actually going to be going back inside. Do you know what that means? Because you're having a baby. Are, are you going to work out right now? <laughs> Do you know what that means? You're gonna have a little brother or a little sister? Cause I'm gonna put her in my wagon. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. If she's, I don't think she's fully comprehending what I'm telling her. Do you know Mama has a baby? Yeah. I don't know what that means. Do you know what that means? No, it's gotta, it's gotta grow, 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 grow. You mm, gonna wiggle out what do you think? On, your, on your tummy? Yeah. When, you, when they're ready, they'll come out. You're gonna have a little bit of a baby. If I hear her, that means she's ready. Right? I expected a different reaction. You know that I can thing? hear her. Yeah. You know how deep you, you know how yeah. um, deep you look so? It's gonna have a baby. It just looks like it's a very thin. She's doing the Ella. Oh, I can hear her. I can really hear her. I'm a mess. You know, you know. You when she gets big, when she gets bigger of me, then she then she can be, and he will be my brother. 